Hello friends, here I'm working with my ducks. In Swedish we call them pigs. <laughs> but uh, I think I get a rather nice shape of this. So I'm not really working with the uh, mock-up profiles. I do it differently. I make them parabolic. Well, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. Yeah, I put up some. I divide it into spaces and each space a square and then I do it from the middle out more from the front less from the back well you see later hello friends this is Irvind making video and uh, now the twin kills are here and uh, the first piece is cut out like this piece here and I made uh, a shape it's not the Naka and it got uh, maximum beam in the middle and it's parabolic and maybe I should it before but this is how it's done just with calculations I divide it into parts one two three four and then I squared each one and then that way I got the parabola and it kind of looks nice to me and now this first piece is cut out here and it's going to be about six pieces on top of each other six times four is 24 so they're going to be 25 centimeter and the one in the bottom and some people say it's a good idea to lean them out like this then when the boat is healing 20 degrees they're vertical but on the other one that one is leaning to the other side so it's not really a good thing because you're losing on it here I made some calculations and if you have them vertical you got the area 1.88 and if they are leading out then you got the area 1.77 and you just do that with the cosine for the angle and some people say I'll move it they just should kind of chew them in because like when then it makes the hurdle goes more straight through the water, but that's not good either because the other one, which especially when you go downwind, it will act like a plough and uh, make drag and resistance and all these things. So, well, I come back to this, and this is just a little for today. So, thank you very much. And have a good time. Bye.